all of you, in just a few minutes we will start our wedding ceremony. But before that, I would like to acknowledge uh, our principal sponsor, Judge Romeo F. Zamora. Good afternoon, sir. Mrs. Uh, Cristina de Guzman. Good afternoon, ma'am. Mrs. Lilia Paliso. And Colonel Boyet de la Cruz. Good afternoon. Attorney Rene Sagisag. Maybe uh, on the way. And of course, Ms. Uh, Lloyd Atan. Good afternoon. And of course, uh, I would like to acknowledge uh, the parents of uh, Hennet, Mr. and Mrs. Uh, Herminio and Helen Pascual. Ay po, ma'am. Pakita yung po, ma'am, to be recognized. Thank you very much for coming over and uh, progressing this wonderful location ng inyong anak. And of course, uh, sa lahat ng mga nagmamahal, kay Michael and uh, Hennet, uh, good afternoon to all of you. And of course, uh, this will be a special Valentine's Day between uh, Michael and uh, Hennet. Before, this is just an ordinary date, but now this is one of the most memorable date to remember in their lives because this is their wedding date. And for that, let's, uh, big, uh, uh, let's clap for uh, Michael and uh, Hennet. Okay, uh, representing uh, Michael Boundaries, uh, Boundaries Family, Mr. Raymond Bilayo. Good afternoon, sir. Yeah. And of course, uh, as I said uh, a while ago, that uh, this is one of the most memorable dates to remember in the life of Michael and Hennet because uh, this will be their wedding date. And for that, we are very happy that uh, we are going to witness uh, this one of the most uh, memorable date in their lives, uh, their wedding. <laughs> and of course, uh, this day belong to Michael and Hennet. Congratulations, Michael, for uh, choosing Hennet to be your wife. After the oath, uh, you will be a husband to Hennet. And of course, uh, for Hennet, I think this will be uh, the boldest decision ever she made uh, in her entire life to be wed to Michael. Michael, take good care of uh, Hennet as she uh, gave her life to you. Okay? Ian, <laughs> akala ko hindi sure. Ian. So, si Michael, I uh, sure na talagang she really, uh, he really in love with uh, Hennet. And for that, uh, he proposed a wedding uh, to Hennet. Bibihira ngayon yung mga lalaki nagpo-propose ng marriage. So we salute uh, Michael for proposing to Hennet, no? Uh, especially uh, this day, talagang uh, it take a lot of guts for a man to uh, propose uh, to a woman ng isang kasal, no? Kaya we congratulate uh, Michael for uh, having done this uh, one of uh, the major decision sa kanyang buhay to be with uh, Hennet for the rest uh, of his life. And of course, we believe in one theology. It's called uh, predestination that before Michael was born, along the way, God formed a woman in the person of Hennet. Kaya hinanap niya yun. At ngayon natagpuan ni uh, Michael uh, the right uh, woman for her. So Michael, Hennet is one of the precious gifts of God to you. Take good care of her. Ayan. And of course, ganun din sa'yo, Hennet, uh, one of the precious gift God ever give to you is Michael. Kaya ingatan mo si Michael, baka mahalin mo si Michael. Ayan. And of course, uh, before we proceed to the wedding ceremony, I would like to acknowledge uh, Judge Romeo Samora to give uh, his uh, message to the couple. Sir, can you do the honor of uh, giving a message to uh, the couple? Dito lang, sir. Pwede po. Dito para may church siya rin sa... Olay. Si Judge. 
Puro globo. All right. Uh, as uh, you said, it's uh, Valentine's Day. And uh, it's a very good day for Michael and Hinet to be married. Talagang well chosen. You understand Tagalog now, Michael? Not yet. Ibibita namin ikaw. All right. Uh, you know, uh, as I've been telling everybody, especially during the uh, solemnization of marriage, I said that uh, the best evidence of love is, as he said, proposing marriage. That is the culmination of engagement. Whether it's a long engagement, say five years, or short one, five days, as long as it resorts to marriage, then it's okay. So, uh, you are here today to consummate what you started. Kailan ba yun? One year ago? Two years ago? Huh? Almost one year. Almost one year. Yeah, I forgot. He, she's always reporting to me about you. <laughs> I said, uh, in, in Tagalog, huwag mo nang pakawalaan. Nantindi mo yan? Do you understand that? No. Oh, I said, she, anyway, he's very handsome, so be sure to catch him. He showed you, she showed to me your picture. I said, it's okay. So, I always say also, that uh, the wedding is more or less symbolical. It's ceremonial. When you are, you put the ring inside, uh, on the finger of your uh, wife, what it means that you are promising to love her eternally because the ring has no end. Walang katapusan yung sing-sing. Diba? It's perpetual round thing. So it will be loving without an end. The putting of a of a veil, even in the church or in other uh, wedding, is also symbolical. When they put the veil on above the head of the woman, it says, no, Hinet, you cannot look at any other man anymore. Only look at Michael. When, however, the, the veil, is so far as a man is concerned, they put it around the shoulder, not above the head. That means, hanggang tingin-tingin ka lang. <laughs> you, know that? you can just look around. You can just look. You can look at the beautiful girls, but that's it. Now, in the, the court, in marriage, it means bonding. So, to me, that is not the best kind of bonding. The best kind is to have children. Then, the bonding is perfect. Okay na? Okay yon. So, uh, my advice to you is you communicate. The best thing to do is communication. Never mind if there is miscommunication. But as long as there is communication, what? We, what you should avoid is no or non-communication. Do you know why Tarzan up to now loves Jane? Because of miscommunication. One day after the honeymoon, he said, Jane, come. We go honeymoon. They use the vine. We, we, Jane, Jane asked him, where's the car? Oh, we don't have a car. We will use the vine. So when I hold the vine, you hold wine. I, what he heard is hold mine. <laughs> so uh, there was this miscommunication though when they went from three to three. Well, uh, Tarsal was holding the wine, but Jane was holding his mind. <laughs> That's why Tarsan is always shouting every time he goes from three to three. Huh? Because, uh, because of the pain. It was painful. <laughs> but pain is just one of the factors in marriage. You have to sacrifice. There is pain 
you are not uh, there is always a thorn in every every garden so you don't you cannot expect to be uh, walking in the park when you get married but it's up to you both so communicate that is my advice to you you communi communicate by holding hands communicate by talking if you have any problem, don't sleep unless you have resolved it before you sleep. If you cannot resolve it, call me up. <laughs> I can help you. <laughs> yeah, no, free. <laughs> yeah, for free. So, okay. Uh, uh, we hope and pray that it will be a, a very successful wedding, that you will live happily thereafter. Okay. Father, continue. Thank you very much, uh, Judge, for uh, the best, uh, best of uh, sense of good sense of humor, no, uh, given to Michael and uh, Hennet. And of course, uh, we also privilege to have here Mrs. Lilia Palisok to give her uh, absent uh, Loida, Miss Loida Tan, I'm Loida Tan. Uh, I just want to say congratulations to you both of you and wish you all the best. More babies. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much, ma'am. Now we will go to uh, Colonel Boyet de la Cruz. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This afternoon we are all a living witness to the union of Michael and Hannah as one. In a simple ceremony we call marriage. And I congratulate you and I wish you the best in this world. Much of everything has been said by my compadre and I presume everyone now is hungry. <laughs> so I will uh, end my um, simple message to you. Congratulations and I wish you the best of the world, Michael and Hannah. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Now we will go to Mrs. Christine de Guzman to... Um, I know both of you are very lucky to find each other. Even at this, uh, the prime of your life, you're... Yeah, yeah, you <laughs> still fall in love. That's right. So uh, I wish you all the best, and uh, hopefully you'll be together soon. In you know, uh, long distance relationship is not good. You all, you have to be together. That's why you have to have that whatever uh, papers processed right away, so that you can be together, whether in the states or here in the Philippines. That's most important. You have to be together. Thank you very you much, ma'am. Now we will go to Mr. Raymond. First and foremost, I'd like to congratulate the couple, Mike and Hennet. And uh, truly, I'm uh, very glad about this wedding. Uh, you know, and even in the short time that I've known Mike, it seems that uh, we've... Uh, we bonded a little bit, and uh, I, think, I think there are things that are very common with us, and that's why we can relate to each other. And uh, for Hannah, I, I'm very happy for Hannah, and uh, for the rest of the family, which I would like to talk in behalf of the family, we are very uh, happy, and we wish the couple an everlasting love, which is... Uh, very typical of uh, the pledges you give uh, to uh, these days. Lahat tayo naalala natin, we all remember uh, uh, things that we pledge during Valentine's Day for everyone who has fallen in love. If you haven't, you're missing something very important in your life. And of course, in the midst of all this love between you, uh, there must be 
eternal love, which is what uh, in the middle of which should be our almighty God. And uh, I wish and pray to our Lord that he, he would bless this wedding and that you'll have a, a very fruitful, fruitful life. That's all. Thank you very much, sir. Now may I call uh, Madam Helen to uh, give her uh, message, especially to Mike, the newest member of your family. Uh, I'm so happy for the couples. Is it? Some day, that can mm. find a man who love her so much, and that I see it really. Mike, that you love my daughter, they take good care of her. Okay, thank you very much, ma'am. You heard it, uh, Michael, uh, from the mother of uh, Hannet, that you should uh, take good care of her daughter. And uh, narinig niyo naman po yung kanyang pangako na talagang uh, kanyang tutuparin at kanyang mamahalin, aalagaan ng inyong anak sa abot ng kanyang makakaya at sa tulong ng Panginoon. This time we will uh, proceed to the ceremony. May I have the wedding ring, please? Yung wedding ring natin. Tayo kayong dalawa, Hennet. Raise your right hand, both of you. Michael, before God, before your parents and the witnesses, do you accept Maria Hennet as your lawful wedded wife? Yes, I do. Do you promise to love and take good care of her? Yes, I do. Maria Hennet, before God, before your parents and the witnesses, do you accept Michael as your lawful wedded husband? Yes, I do. Do you promise to love and take good care of her? Okay? Yes, I do. Okay, our questions at isa. Face one another. Hold your hands together. Michael, look at the eyes of uh, Hennet. Repeat after me. Hennet. Yes. I accept you. I accept you as my lawful wedded wife, as my lawful wedded wife, for better or worse, for better or worse, for poorer or richer, for poorer or richer, in sickness and in health, in sickness and health, 